Why, hello everyone. Welcome back to Bug Night. We have seen an end, but we are not done. No, we are not. The Bug Night adventure continues. Because although we have seen an ending, there is plenty more to find. Hollow Nest has lots of mysteries to discover, and by gosh, we're going to discover all of them. So, today begins, at last, the royal backtracking. We are going to go zone by zone, and I am going to try to, once again, like, explore every nook and cranny to the best of my ability with the abilities I have. So, get your marker out of here. You're done. And, uh... But we're basically going to cut out all the wandering around and me not finding things. And uh, we'll come back in as soon as I find anything interesting. So uh, I guess we're going to be starting with, like, uh, yeah, Howling Cliffs. That's where we are going to begin. I'm sure I'll probably still miss stuff, despite my best efforts. But uh, it's all right. The backtracking is a process, everyone. Here we go! Oh, yes, I forgot about this little area. What was in here? Hmm. Okay. I don't remember this. Like, I know I came in here, but... Oh, right! That's right. Nailmaster, how it goes? That nail art, the dash slash. Learned from my brother Oro, was it not? So he's still alive, then. Hmm. Still haven't forgotten what he owes me, and I never will. Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't bother you with such things. I'm happy that you were able to train under another nail master and grow stronger, my pupil. Finelo, bam. Oh, so my brother Shio's taught you his nail art, the Great Slash. How lucky you are to have trained up with him. Shio and I were very close when we trained together under the Great Nail Sage. He often spoke of becoming tired of the nail arts and wanted to try something new. I'm glad to see he changed his mind, continues to bear the proud title of nail master along with me. That charm! Could it be? Only the great Nail Sage himself could have bestowed such a thing. Your achievements humble my own, my pupil. I myself have sworn never to lay eyes on the Nail Sage again, not until I have truly mastered his teachings. But if you see him again, please, let him know that I am forever grateful. And before you leave, rest and meditate with me for a while. Your company is always welcome. Ha. <sighs> Okay, I'm bored. What are you thinking about? My brother, Shio. How fare you in that green kingdom of thorns you call home? I think of you every time I raise my nail. Do you ever close your eyes and remember that time we spent together with Oro and our master? I like to think you do. Indeed. Wonder what went down with this little... family. Anyway, moving on! Ooh, let's investigate Joni's repose again. Pretty sure I didn't have the dream nail last time I was here. Not sure if there's gonna be more to find, but it is definitely worth looking, yes? I think so. Also, there's tons of butterflies, which is fun. Bug Knight enjoys butterflies. See, they're so pretty, why wouldn't you? Ah! Oh, it's lovely. Hey! I see you bear my blessing. I can't remember giving it, but my memory has been a little lacking of late. Isn't it just so peaceful here? Such a perfect place to rest. Blue Child Joni. Hmm. Thought there might be more here, but still, that's neat. Hooray. Moving on! Hmm. What was in here? There's some sort of treat in here. Darn if I can remember, though. Oh, yeah! I remember you. Hmm. The corpse of a large bug. And I think that's about where it ended last time, but... Huh. 
It's getting dreamy over here. Are we still dreamy? Huh. Okay, I'm seeing dreamy stuff in the sky. Whoa! What's this now? Huh. Whoa! Cool. Um. Huh. Well? Hello? Um. Hmm. All right, torches are still lit. What's going on here? Hello? Something screwy going on here. Maybe... Can I climb? Can I... Huh. This seems like really important. Huh. I'm so confused, large bug corpse. Really seems like that should have been something, but... Okay. Now, some of y'all insisted that there was something else to find out here at the Lake of Un. And I was kind of wanting to come out here for a nice big swim, so, uh... Let's investigate. Well, let's see what's in here. Nothing different, probably, right? I figured not. Okay. Does that statue-y sort of thing back there remotely resemble that, uh... bug who gave me the flower to travel with? That's a stretch, right? Yeah, probably not. Anyway, swimming! Yay! Oh, it's so nice. A toasty hot tub. Well, nothing so far. You know what, this is gonna be a lot faster if we, uh... Whoosh. There we go. Now. Yes! Perfect! Perfect! What do we got, though? Hmm. Hello? Anyone back here? Hello? What a nice little hot springs cave you have. Anyone home? I do like it in here. Anyone? Hmm. Okay. Anyone, though? Whoa! Hello. Oh, this place is huge. Hello? What's going on? Whoa! You're so big. Yeah! Oh. Huh. What is that? Shape of Un. Reveals the form of Un within the bearer. While focusing soul, the bearer will take on a new shape and can move freely to avoid enemies. Whoa! That's a wild one. Also, Slug? Hello? You're still in here? Slug? Slug. Hmm. Wasn't expecting to make a slug friend today. That was fun. New charm. Anyway, moving on, I guess. Oh, 
Wait a minute. Why, hello, what have we here? Hey. I was picking up a thing. Shoo. Bad plant. Neat. Got a journal. Heh. Awesome. You know, as long as I'm here at the stag stop, I kind of want to go to the, uh, stag... Whatever it's called. The, uh, stag nest. That's the one. Poke around there just a little more. I think I found everything, but, um, if nothing else, I want to try jumping off the top. Gotta try that out. It's so high up. Here we are. Okay, so according to the map, we're very high. Let's see how far we can go. Anything? Anything? And nope. <laughs> uh, hello, Dirt Myth. What happened? Um. Hey, uh. Elder, what happened? Oh, look there. Something strange and sinister has suddenly appeared. Ugh, it fills me with dread. I think at best I try to ignore it. <laughs> Yes, I understand. I, too, don't want to have to add any additional dialogue to myself. So, okay, Dirtmouth is fine. But, uh, like... <laughs> hey, do y'all notice? There's a circus? There's a circus. Alright, well, whatever. I'm gonna go see the circus. Greta, you stay here and listen to Zote. What's going on? Who are you? The roads between are dark and long, but the master's light will always guide us. Okay. Huh. You're sort of leg eater esque. Ah. Did you call us? You called us, and we came, we came. You don't look scared. Why did you call us? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. Don't tell me. We came, and I can smell something. Something deep below us. I want it. I want it! Is it leg eater? Do you want leg eater? That smell! Ugh! You're hiding something very nice from me, aren't you? Shouldn't hide something so nice. Show me. Show me! Put it on, quickly! Uh... Are you- are you wanting me to put on the, like, Leg Eater's charms? Is that what you're hinting at here? Shadow and fire will dance together so prettily, I think. Yikes. Well, here, I'll try on charms, I guess, but, um... I've got a lot going on. I don't have time to play dress up for weirdo circus folk who just barged into my town. I'm king now, I think. I'm a little unclear on whether I am technically king of this land, but, um, I like to think of myself as such. Uh... Sure, I don't- I don't know, man. Let's, uh... Let's just put on all of these charms. Fragile heart, which increases the health of the bearer, allowing them to take more damage. Uh, fragile greed, which, uh, causes the bearer to find more geo when defeating enemies. And fragile strength, which strengthens the bearer, increasing the damage they deal to enemies with their nail. Great! I love them all. They're all great. Are these what you wanted? I'm having a very confusing day. What do you think? Ah! That charm, beautiful. Most precious thing. Little lovely, will you let me see it? Have to show it to me. Sure. All yours. Ah! Such a little beauty. Such a smell. Such a smell. Ah. Hey. That was mine. Ah, so good. So tasty. A perfect, perfect thing. Just for me. Ah. Do you want the other two? Are you hungry? 
Beautiful. Delicious. Arr. You're good, little lovely. You're very sweet to bring me such a gift. The, poor first. the one who made my gift. Arr. Somewhere below? Yes. Very good gift. Very tasty. Delicious. I've already got do you want something, little lovely? You don't want to take my gift back, do you? Arr, so nasty, so cruel if that's true. Once you give something as a gift, it's lost to you forever. I feel like it's not, though. A gift? For you? So greedy. But I can show you something if you're nice to me, little lovely. Will you do a nice thing, lovely? Give them to me, your Geo. Give me your Geo, and I'll give you a gift. Whoa! <laughs> not enough Geo. <laughs> No Geo? Why? Why don't you have enough Geo? Well, listen, I try, okay? I have to find it all in rocks and stuff. This is we You know what? I'm gonna go get some more money. I just want to see what happens. Hang on. Oh. Hello. Who are you? Hey. Did you weren't here before. Delica. Relic Seeker Lem. Oh? What are you doing out in this miserable downpour? Impressive fountain, isn't it? I'm sure we'd be able to appreciate it more if we weren't both getting drenched. That night up there was an important one. The plaque here mentions its sacrifice, which carries something of an ominous tone. Probably met some sort of horrible end, though it sounds like the knight's goal may have been achieved in the process. In all the relics I've collected, I've yet to find a clue as to what that was. I'm Bug Knight. Who are you? Kachail, Liyasoki. I'll be getting back to the shop soon. If I stay out here too long, I'll get washed into the waterways. Come and visit if you like. If you have relics, I mean. I'm not much for shatter. Oh wait, this Lim! This is Lim, the, uh, the little shopkeep bug that I was heading toward. He's just sitting out here now, okay. Didn't recognize you outside your shop. Memorial to the Hollow Knight. In the black vault far above, through its sacrifice, Hollow Nest lasts eternal. Hmm. Hey, Lemmy, can you get back to your shop? I need to buy things. Who were you, Mystery Knight? Why no mention beyond your fountain? Indeed. I'm gonna go shopping. Lamb, keep up. Wow, you move quick. How'd you get up here so fast? Velmi Artrid. And I guess I'm not really shopping. I'm just I'm selling you things. Uh, let's see. An arcane egg. Ah, this seems like a simple egg, but it's actually a precious relic from before the birth of Hollow Nest. I'll pay you a small fortune for it. Please sell it to me. You know what? You got it. I need so much bug money. And an arcane egg, eh? Now this, this is an ancient thing. These relics are the prize of my profession. There's knowledge hidden within, though it's very difficult, painstaking work to extract. One large understanding can be gleaned, though. This civilization may claim itself the first, but something else did exist within this place before Hollow Nest. Each egg offers a narrow glimpse into that forgotten age. Velmi Artrid. Fascinating. Thank you for details and stuff, but also for money. Bug money. Which I need. Boris Sun? Kian. A king's idol. If you look closely, each of these idols is subtly different. There are fine engravings about them that take some time to decipher. I suspect each was tailored to the owner. A personalized symbol of the king's omnipotence. Velmi Artrid. Boy, I need so much bug money. Chale, Another king's idol. Have you visited the remnants of his palace? It's down below this city, in the bedrock of the kingdom. Must have been an impressive sight in its time. Now there's nothing left. It's a strange thing, though. There are no signs of conflict around the area. It's as though the whole place just vanished. I didn't expect to get lore for every single one of these we sold. That's awesome. 
Uh, um, yes. Velmi Artrit. A king's idol. I've often wondered the true visage of the king. Depictions are of an imposing, gleaming figure and a fiercely horned crown. I suspect there's much embellishment in the imagery, though. A ruler seeking worship tends to hide their blemishes. It'd do no good to appear a common bug. Velmi Artrit. Okay, I need just a little more. How about a wanderer's journal? Oh, Paul. Another wanderer's journal. I might not offer a lot for each, but they're plentiful about the caverns, and I doubt you'll find another willing to make trade for Geo. Velmi Artrit. Nothing else other than that, huh? That's fine. Thank you for all the money. I needed it. Hey, weirdo, I brought you your small fortune. You want a gift? Greedy, give me Geo, and you will get a gift. Here you go. Yowza. Oh boy. Um, thank you. Unbreakable heart, eh? That smell, here. Yeah. You're hiding something very nice from me, aren't you? Shouldn't hide something so nice. Show me, show me, put it on quickly. I better check and see what this actually is I just got. You know what, I'm gonna do it outside. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, unbreakable heart increases the health of the bearer, allowing them to take more damage. This charm is unbreakable, aha. Uh -huh. Okay, that's very good and so expensive. Wow, okay, cool. These things are gonna start really competing for a uh, notch space soon, as soon as I find 24,000 more bug monies. We'll get there eventually, I guess. What is in here? Hello? Oh. Babala Geno. Hmm, you called us. Speak to Master. When flames burn bright inside one's mind, kin heed the call across lands and time. Okay. Hello? Whoa. Okay, this is pretty great already. Awesome. Hello? So it was you who called us. Well met, my friend. Well met. I am Grim, master of this troop. The lantern has been lit, and your summons heeded. A fine stage you choose, this kingdom fallowed by worm and root, perfect earth upon which our ritual shall take place. And you, my friend, your own part is far from over. As the lantern flared, your role was cast, our compact written in scarlet fire. Eager we are to see you commence, but first, some illuminations required. Oh. Go, so man. Across these lands, my kin now spread, harvesting that essence peculiar to my breed, the flame in dream. Seek my kin, claim their flame, and return it to me. Together, marvels shall be achieved. But don't fret, small one. For this task, you won't travel alone. My child shall guide you to the flame and gather within itself that burning essence. Like you, the child plays key role in this task. Only with it by your side will the flame and my kin reveal themselves to you. Well. Well. Well, <laughs> I don't know what to say. All is weird. Um, you did, you could have warned me. The flame, seek it out. For master, for our kin. Mm. Did you know that the accordion you're playing is of another bug? I only mentioned just because it's, it's a little weird, but all right. Well, we're poor, we have a new charm, 
we have a new circus, I guess, in our realm. And, uh... Yeah. What's that charm about? Grim Child. Warned by those who take part in the Grim Troop's ritual, the bearer must seek the Grimkin and collect their flames. Uncollected flames will appear on the bearer's map. Is that so? All right. Where are the flames? Show me the flames, though. Not seeing any flames. Guess I gotta put it on. Uh, hang on. <laughs> Definitely keeping Gathering Swarm on now. Good grief. Uh, quick slash, get out of here for a second. Gotta see what's up. Okay. Whoa! Hang on! Oh, we have a buddy! Hello, buddy! Oh, you're adorable. Oh, you're so cute. Hey, stop trying to get behind me. I'm trying to... I'm trying to have a conversation. Ugh. Okay. Well, you're adorable. Um... Is stuff on the map? Whoa, it is. Okay. Nifty. Alright. Is that you making that sound? Hang on. That is you making that sound. You're adorable. What a good little friend. Okay. Uh, we're gonna have to go to these places, I guess. Jeepers. Well. You know, we got a little time, I think. Because of all the backtracking, cutting, and such. Let's go to the City of Tears. And see what that little fire is about, huh? Let's go, little buddy. We're gonna ride a stag. Oh, you'll love it. Hey, Stag, have you met my new little buddy? What do you think? Stag doesn't talk much. Okay, to the city storerooms. Away! <laughs> See you in fun. What do you think of my buddy? Okay, well... Rude. Don't mind Stagbird, buddy. I gotta come up with a name for you. I feel like... What is it? Grimkin? Grimchild. That sucks. We can come up with something better. Uh... Could call you Grimmels, which is... Ah! Oh! Ah, hey! Don't throw things. Whoa, that's faster than I thought you could move. Huh. Stop it. What a rude little thing. So giggly, though. I love the slight bit of distortion on the laughs, though. It's subtle, but it's very good. Stop! So giggly. Come on. Ah, missed. Ah. Come on. Mm, too slow. There we go. All right, buddy, eat up. Flame consumed, eh? Nifty. Okay, um... Yeah, all right, that's one flame consumed. What did you think? Tasty? Good? Yes? Fantastic. Well, as long as you're happy. Yo, let's, um, maybe go find a bench, huh? Stag? Stag, things are getting weird. <sighs> well, y'all, have yourselves a good one, and I'll see you tomorrow for some more flame hunting for the circus. Um, maybe we'll come up with a name for 
this. Anyway, y'all, y'all have yourselves a good one. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye!